Brad Nelson, a roboticist at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology, has turned the concept of a flight simulator back to front. Instead of allowing people to feel like they're flying, his simulator gives flies a taste of what it's like to be earthbound. A fruit fly inside the simulator controls the movement of a wheeled robot driving around a forest of pillars. Output from the robot's camera generates patterns shown to a tethered fly on a cylindrical display of light-emitting diodes. Although the hapless fly cannot move, the patterns fool the fly to think it can, so it tries to dodge obstacles when they appear. At the same time, cameras monitor the life force and movements of the fly's wing and translate the data into instructions that direct the robot around the obstacles. Nelson and his colleagues hope that by gaining an insight into how the modest fruit fly can perform such complex tasks, they'll be able to create better control systems for robots. A software version of the fly's nervous system could eventually produce flight control software for tiny robotic flies. 